So just got to the shop, got my spoiler delivered, it's painted. Uh, we'll see how this is gonna work out. It looks really nice. So I gotta get these out. Um, my car is super dirty right now, but <sighs> it's got two, one here, one down here. One here, one up here. Um, <clears throat> I'm assuming these bolts up here will be covered by the new spoiler, but these will not. So, gonna for now, I actually bought a. I thought they were plugs. I bought them on eBay, and they're just stickers. So I ordered. Uh, I typed in spoiler hole plugs, and they look like plugs, but they're actually just. You can change, you can order them in different colors. Yeah. And that's all that is. For now, I guess I'm gonna be using these just so water doesn't go in there. But I eventually gotta get that plugged up and sanded and repainted so so these holes won't be here. Alright, let's take a look, let's see if we can get this done. Alright, so I got the bolts out. They're not that easy to do because I didn't have the right tool for it. Let's see if I can do this with one hand. Damn. On there pretty tight. Um, I'm gonna set this uh, phone down for a second. Let me see if I can pull it out because it's actually pretty on there pretty tight. Okay, that was a Bit of a struggle there. These things are ripped. Look at this. There. So there it is. The wing. Oops. So it looks like the new spoiler is a little shorter. A little bit. There it is. Um, so let's see what we can do to get this installed. I'm loving it so far. It's not on there, I just placed it on there. Um, you can see these holes now. No bueno. Let's see what we can do with these. Okay, so I popped them on there. They don't look very nice. But, like I said, it's only temporary. Um, I'm gonna fill those holes up and get them painted. Uh, for now, no water will get in there. So let's see how I can install this spoiler. I think I'm gonna start, there's three, there's three mount bolts. One, two, two, and three. So maybe I'm gonna start with the first one. But right here, all around this, there's a little, um, sealer thing that they sent me. I think I have it in my car. Let me check. Okay, so here it is. Um, so I'm assuming these things here, that's a sealer. That, that's where it goes around the, the spoiler. Here are the, the screws that bolt in there. These are, there's three of them. So what I'm thinking that happens, um, I'm assuming you pop them in here like this, align that, center them, then tape them, tape them down from the outside of it, here and here, and then you'll know where to screw. Okay, so <clears throat> here's what I've been doing so far, or what I've done so far. Um, so I got this centered, the, the spoiler, I used this to help me guide where the hole was. I had taped it on where the hole was. You see the that that goes in where the bolt goes in. Put that on there, it sticks out like these, you see? Right here and right here. So then um once I, I centered it, I taped it down. So when you lift it lift the spoiler up, 
the that that piece stays right there so you know where to drill through i screwed it in already through the center right there um i screwed it in just so i can line these up because you see it's a gap so you gotta force it down so now i'm gonna take the spoiler off again and drill the holes where i tape them up okay so this was not that easy actually so I drill the holes here and here. These were the from the old spoiler, but um, then you have to also make a bigger hole on this side. Let's see. And it's actually not that easy because when you're trying to drill in here, it happened to me over here. You can see that this hole's kind of the the little one. It's a little weird because when you try to drill through here, the, the drill just pierces right through and then wants to come out through the other side. So keep that in mind. Um, you gotta drill nice and slow. Like these are really sloppy because my drill just kept, I don't know if it just had too much force that it was just trying to go right through it. So I'm gonna use this sealer. It's gotta go all through this groove right here so the water won't go in. And there it is. Installed. What a difference it makes, huh? It's a little smaller, but remember, we still have the uh, we still have the wicker bill to install. I just don't want to mess it up, but it looks great just the way, it, just as is. I mean, look at that. Changes it. The difficulty it's um to install it it's maybe a um one out of ten ten being extremely hard it could be like a five or six maybe because I, I didn't have anyone helping me hold it you just got to make sure to center it properly and then like i said um when you drill the two bolts on the side from the inside of the trunk Try to not go all the way through so you don't make the hole bigger from the front from the top but it's, it's not that bad boom there it is so wicker bills on as you can see ran into a few problems a wicker bill that i received was too long for my spoiler so my spoiler, because it's an aftermarket, it just didn't fit the wicker bill. Um, it was too long and I ran into a few problems. So I had to really force, force it here. I had to push down because when you put this bolt in, this part was actually sticking out this way, like upwards. And I had to like push it down and then bolt it in. And it created this groove. So you can see the the kind of a bow that goes here. And same on this end. You'll see a bow here. It it actually really bothers me. Um, and on top of that, because I had to bolt this into like a really thin part of here. When I was drilling the hole here, it just pierced right through the, the spoiler there. That's a, There's a hole in here. I just put some black tape there. So at the time I was like, I'll just uh, get the hole patched and then, and then get this whole piece repainted. But uh, what I'm thinking now is I'm gonna just, just buy a new spoiler, a proper spoiler, the one that's meant for this specific um wicker bill get it painted and then redo this whole process because it's just gonna bother me i mean it looks really cool like it looks good from afar you know i think it looks cool but small details that we have to take care of so for now, it's just going to stay like this. Oh. 
we'll see.